Hi, we are going to now go through phonics, what I do to teach my three-year-old how to read. We start with the Abeka phonics card, so I go through them with him. So go ahead and go. D. Good. I. F. Y. And we keep going through all the alphabet cards until we get to one that he might not know. Let me find one that he might not know. S. Okay, never mind. Well, if he doesn't know one of them, then I put it in the back and we keep going until we've gone through all the phonics cards. After that, we usually play some swamp. Some swamp is my favorite way to teach math, and I know that's not phonics, but it's incorporated into this time period because I have the time to do it. What I like about some swamp is it teaches plus and minus or addition and subtraction, and it's fun to play and it's quick to play. What it has is you go around the board, you roll three dice, and then, so for instance, actually Benjamin, how about you roll? Mommy, go we're going to be snakes. Okay, we'll be snakes today. What? That's how you roll. Okay, go ahead and roll. So, Benjamin's the green snake. Okay, so no, what? No, I'm the blue snake. Okay, so what numbers do you have? Six, six minus seven, one. one. So six, and then take away one finger. One, two, three, four, five. So go ahead and move five spaces. One, two, three, four, five. Good. And we're not going to play the entire game. But you can see basically how it works. It has plus and minus. It goes through numbers one through six. And in addition to that, it has numbers that you land on and then you roll a plus or minus and you go forward or backward that number. And you also have even and odd numbers. And if you roll an even number, you get to move that many spaces. If you roll an odd number and you're on, on an odd space, you get to move forward that many spaces. And so it teaches additional concepts. So we play through that game once. And then I do teach your child how to read in 100 easy lessons. And we're just starting this right now. And he is my fifth child that I am teaching to read using this book. So this is what a lesson looks like. I won't do the entire lesson. So you're going to say all these sounds. Mm. Good. E. Very good, this one. This is the new one from yesterday. Remember, it goes t. Can you do it? T. Good. This one. This one. A. Good job. Now you're going to rhyme. You're going to rhyme with this sound. What is it? Yes. And you're going to rhyme with een. What will you rhyme with? E. So start with this sound. And then. E. And what word is that? E. C. E. Very good. So we finish up this and so that he enjoys reading, he gets a chocolate chip each lesson that he does in this. And I will move on to another subject in a moment. You can stop now. Thank you.